Hyperscale Data, formerly known as Alt Alliance, operates data centers for Bitcoin mining and offers co-location and hosting services for industries such as AI ecosystems. They also provide mission-critical products in sectors like defense, aerospace, automotive, medical, biopharma, and hotel operations through their subsidiaries Centinum, ACS, and BNI Montana. Hyperscale Data has reportable segments in fintech, Bitcoin mining, Centinum, real estate holdings, Agree, energy and infrastructure solutions, energy, AI-driven data insights, and social gaming platform, ROI, and commercial electronics and EV charging solutions, Turn On Green. Centinum primarily generates revenue from mining Bitcoin for its own account, but plans to transition primary operations to developing its Michigan data center. This energy-efficient facility aims to cater to the growing demand of enterprise HPC and AI cloud providers with high-density workloads. Centinum operates two data centers in Michigan and Montana offering bespoke solutions for industries like healthcare, energy, automotive, robotics, and other autonomous systems. The company is exploring opportunities to add HPC and AI applications, while also monitoring critical equipment supply chains. Currently, Centinum mines Bitcoin using purpose-built computers to solve complex cryptographic algorithms and participates in a mining pool to receive block rewards and transaction fees. As a subsidiary of Hyperscale Data, Centinum has been mining Bitcoin since 2021 and received around 3,017 Bitcoins for providing computing power to a mining pool operator. They had an MSA with Core Scientific until August 31, 2024, which allowed them to mine Bitcoin through December 31, 2024. Centinum sells the mined Bitcoin to fund operating expenses due to ongoing losses. Their integrated model enables cost-efficient Bitcoin production compared to third-party hosting relationships. In the second half of 2023 and up to December 31, 2024, their net cost of power was between $42 to $62 per megawatt hour. They had approximately 16,000 miners in operation during those years, generating around 677 and 1,607 bitcoins in each respective year for providing computing power to a bitcoin mining pool operator and hosted mining operations with Core Scientific. The company participates in a Luxor mining pool using the full paper share method, which distributes transaction fees based on each miner's hash power contribution. The business believes in the advantages Bitcoin offers over traditional currencies in terms of fraud deterrence, immediate settlement, elimination of counterparty risk, lower fees, identity theft prevention, widespread accessibility, verified transactions through confirmation process and decentralization. However, there are limitations faced by Bitcoin mining companies due to the limited supply of Bitcoin and the market price volatility. The controlled rate of Bitcoin creation ensures that there will never be more than 21 million Bitcoins, and this restricts revenue growth for mining companies unless the price increases or they acquire more miners. Additionally, the fluctuating price of Bitcoin is influenced by factors such as investor sentiment, regulatory developments, media coverage, acceptance as currency, and market demand. The speculative and volatile nature of Bitcoin poses risks to these companies' prospects for future revenue and profits. Centinum's strategy involves owning and operating their mining facilities, focusing on deploying miners at locations with access to reliable, low-cost renewable power to reduce power costs. The company purchased the Michigan facility and has invested in infrastructure improvements, increasing its power capacity from 1.5 megawatts to approximately 30 megawatts and aiming for a potential increase to 340 megawatts. They also have a data center through BNI Montana with up to 10 megawatts of power capacity, but have put expansion plans on hold due to current Bitcoin price and mining difficulty levels. Yet they continue to evaluate other sites and partnerships for future mining operations expansion. The mined Bitcoin is held in a custodial account at Gemini Trust Company, which provides secure storage and insurance coverage against theft or hacks. Hyperscale data either holds the Bitcoin or converts it into fiat currency to pay operating costs and fund expansion activities. Alt Lending provides commercial loans and investments to businesses in the U.S. offering operating capital for growth. They offer loan types including short-term commercial loans, convertible notes, and revolving lines of credit. Alt Lending assesses each borrower's creditworthiness using financial data and a credit scoring model. Their management team has experience in financial transactions and approves all lending decisions. The company generates revenue through origination fees and interest on loans, while also considering opportunities to sell subsidiary or partner companies for maximum value. Riskon International primarily operates through BNC, which develops and manages an online gaming platform. 
The platform offers various gaming options, including participation in games, sweepstakes, and social gaming experiences. They aim to provide innovative ways for people in the United States to interact online. Their business strategy revolves around creating a seamless, all-encompassing platform that caters to various user needs and interests, particularly in sweepstakes and social gaming experiences. Ask ROI is an AI-powered software-as-a-service platform that helps businesses gain a competitive edge by leveraging their data. It integrates with various business tools and offers contextualized understanding, actionable insights through custom reports and visualizations, transparency and security measures, ethical AI implementation, and a partner ecosystem for tailored solutions. The platform's main feature is its state-of-the-art large language model exclusively licensed from a third-party provider, which allows it to interpret complex queries and provide highly contextualized responses while continuously learning and adapting to each organization's unique language and terminology. Ask ROI's business strategy involves continuously refining their core product based on beta user feedback and rolling it out in stages to different sectors. They plan to leverage their exclusive licensing agreement for LLM technology in North America to stand out in the market and attract customers seeking advanced AI solutions. They also aim to expand accessibility by offering mobile-friendly experiences through dedicated applications in Apple and Google app marketplaces. Additionally, they want to broaden integration partnerships, focus on real-world use cases, build a strong partner ecosystem, and invest in research and development to maintain a competitive edge in natural language processing machine learning, and data analytics. The goal is to position Ask ROI as a leading AI-powered insights engine for data-driven decision-making and operational excellence. Ask ROI's unique positioning as an AI-powered insights engine operates exclusively on its own data, setting it apart from generic AI tools and other enterprise search and analytics platforms. Key differentiators include exclusive access to advanced LLM, seamless integration with existing business tools, the ability to provide company-specific context, and a focus on delivering actionable insights while maintaining data security and privacy. The market for AI-driven business tools is expanding, and Ask ROI aims to capture market share through its advanced capabilities, ease of use, and commitment to customer success. Circle 8 is a lifting services provider operating in Texas, Oklahoma, Louisiana, and New Mexico, with five branches. The company specializes in oil field services, construction, commercial, refining, marketing, and wind energy markets. They have a diverse fleet of 57 cranes from leading OEMs such as Grove, Liebherr, and Shuzhou Construction Machinery Group. Circle 8 strengths include their comprehensive lifting solutions platform, strong safety record, high-quality fleet with the opportunity for expansion, and diversified blue-chip customers. The U.S. lifting solutions, equipment distribution, and rental industry experienced consolidation activities in 2024 with United Rentals acquiring H&E Equipment Services for $4.8 billion and completing the acquisition of Yak Access for $1.1 billion. Other companies like Herc Holdings also pursued growth through acquisitions. The industry remains highly fragmented, consisting of multi-location regional or national operators and small independent businesses serving local markets. Factors influencing the industry's dynamics include trends in U.S. residential and non-residential construction, demand for construction machinery, and region-specific considerations. Agree invests in diverse commercial real estate asset classes, focusing on hospitality and future multifamily properties. They target middle market segments in areas with strong fundamentals and growth potential. Agree aims to deliver attractive, risk-adjusted returns by combining ground-up development, capital investments, and operational enhancements that unlock long-term value. In the hospitality sector, they prioritize both physical improvements and elevated guest experiences to drive performance through their subsidiary Agree Madison, which operates four recently renovated hotel properties in the Midwest. Turn on Green is an emerging provider of premium power electronic and EV charging solutions, serving sectors like defense and aerospace, medical and healthcare, industrial applications, telecommunications, e-mobility, and OEM solutions. Their products are highly adaptive with customized firmware to meet specific customer requirements. Around 8% of their revenue comes from delivering comprehensive EV charging infrastructure and subscription-based charging network management services for different environments. Digital Power, a subsidiary of Turn On Green, offers integrated power system solutions with high efficiency, flexibility, and scalability, along with industry-standard power products like AC, 
DC open frame product series, and high power laser power supplies tailored for specific applications. For more on hyperscale data and the businesses they oversee, follow Ascencore. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.